Hi everybody, this is going to be a very quick video. I just wanted to point out a couple of things with the new patch. If you come to this person here, Fieldmaster Embereth, Embereth, this person sells, I don't, I don't know, if, it looks like a guy. Anyway, he sells these techniques for inscription and they just take uh, three Awakened Ire and you can see I've already sold uh, four of those and so definitely made my money back on on those uh, <clears throat> so those are a quick way of getting the obsidian stuff if you have other characters that you want to use uh, PvP with or if you want to sell the uh, trinkets on the auction house secondly choice. there's this person here Corganar Smolder Forge. I'm a Luke. He sells all the Crimson Combatants gear. So you can come here if you, assuming you have these Marks of Honor. Uh, I've I've been doing a lot of PvP uh, on multiple characters, so I've I've obtained quite a bit of it. Uh, but you can. I was, you know, when I was thinking earlier earlier this morning, I was thinking, well, guy, you know, I you're not going to be able to get this stuff anymore. So I, I started looking around, and and sure enough, uh, on Wowhead, it's like, oh, hey, you can just buy these with the Marks of Honor. So what you could do is come out here and look. Uh, you can probably use TSM and get an idea of how much some of this stuff is selling for. And if assuming you have enough Marks of Honor, uh, you can buy these and post them on the auction house. Or, or if you never bought any of these to begin with uh, this might be a good opportunity to fill out uh, the rest of your uh, recipes if you're a tailor uh, let's see tailor leather worker leather worker uh, blacksmith uh, inscriptionist as well so there's some inscriptions here uh, as well as the uh, jewel crafting ones so I think you know there might actually be some engineering ones I, I may need to check on that to see uh, if one of my, my engineer can uh, learn them. So that's the other thing is, you know, if you haven't crafted one of those, your first craft, you get a knowledge point. So that's like, it might be sort of expensive to get a knowledge point that way, but uh, that would be, you know, another way if, you, if you're if you looking to get a knowledge point, uh, but uh, probably also good for, you know, just auctioning. I'm, I'm going to check my other character that i posted them on and see if uh, any of them sold but some of them uh, were getting rarer and rarer with people doing uh, PvP and now they don't drop in PvP but not everybody probably knows about this vendor yet so it might be a good uh, good idea to, to get those now so anyway take care